is the president coming. That's it. He's coming back to the office, to the White House. There's the president's choppers arriving at the White House after his break down in Florida. Tennessee, Louisiana, Mississippi, Alabama, Missouri, Michigan, Texas, Kansas, Nevada, Colorado, South Dakota, Washington, Wyoming, Oklahoma, Arizona, Alaska, Puerto Rico, Philippines, Virginia, the Virgin Islands, and American entities during World War II. hat has been off for all the fallen soldiers. There are many visitors here that truly do not understand even to respect. They have very little respect they should show to a war memorial. Take the hat off at least as a, a reminder of the freedom and freedom of movement that you have and uh, very little of that has been reminded by too many. I've just not even had the respect to take the hat off as they walk through the memorial here in DC. You can see a column there for the Pacific War. There's a column there for the Atlantic War. Yes, this nation endured across two seas for the freedom here in the presence of Washington and Lincoln one of the 18th century father and the other the 19th century preserver of our nation we honor those 20th century Americans who took up the struggle during the Second World War and made the sacrifice to the perpetuate The gift our forefathers entrusted to us. A nation conceived in liberty and justice. What a fitting statement. And what a, a touching and very reminding statement that was made here at this war memorial in DC. Much said, what is truly important is for us to all remember that no war will save life, yet it will sacrifice countless numbers of lives for the freedom of very few. If we do not practice the very written words in its true entirety and respect all living and embrace all living as it is, that we should remind ourselves what is truly to be a living being on earth. 